Hi, Fran Torson here. Let's take a look at a very cool uh, feature here of Social Video Spark, and that is the YouTube Downloader. Here we can take a look for videos we could publish on our Facebook page. Here we can publish YouTube videos that are published with Creative Commons license. That means we can share that. We're allowed to share that. We need to show appropriate attribution and this program builds the attribution right into our post. So let's get, let's get, just quick, take a quick example here. Let's say I live in Tucson, Arizona. A presidential candidate has just visited town and I want to see if anybody has published anything on the event on you know that I can share so I might say Tucson Bernie Sanders he was there last week let's see if we have any YouTube videos yeah here we go so here is a video of Bernie Sanders in Tucson an estimated 11,000 people showed up we can take a look we can preview the video right all right we can look all the way through we see we've got some stuff there okay so that's about a four minute video if that's something i want to share i can do that i click load video and i can publish this video or any part of it um, with any type of watermark or intro or outro that i even have set up in my in my setting so let's say i want to publish this as a news item I can do that um, and then the news settings will apply to that so the intro that i've selected the uh, the link and the outro will all be attached to that video when i post it so i'll say load video now and uh, it's being processed and while we wait for the video to be loaded all right and processed let's just take a look and uh, as, and quickly review what those auto settings are um, now we had called that one a news story, right? I picked a video and these are the settings that should be applied to that. So I want the action type to say watch more. I'm using the URL link to my fan page and I have selected an intro video that looks like this. It says citizen news and it's a, just a newsy kind of a, of a beginning there, right? And the outro videos, um, I selected this one over here. It says, thanks for watching. So when that video is processed, the YouTube video I selected should appear with the intro I picked here and the outro I selected here. So let's go and just check and see our videos. There we have a new video right there. There it is, and it says Creative Commons Attribution. So let's see if, how the video looks. It's opening with our intro. All right, this is the video about Bernie Sanders. Let me take this all the way toward the end there to check out the outro. There it is, so that has been applied automatically. Now, if I want, I have two options here. I can either post that to Facebook or I can download the video to my hard drive. So I, if I select post to Facebook, it will give, it will apply the co Creative Commons attribution and the appropriate link there. And I can give it a title, a description and a post message. And I can, you know, send that to uh, any of the profiles that I want on my profile page.